Singapore will boost bilateral ties with the Middle East as Prime Minister Lee Hsien Lung begins a six-day trip there, starting in Saudi Arabia. Mr Lee is set to attend an inaugural leaders' summit between ASEAN and the Gulf Cooperation Council later this week. Now, this is Mr Lee's second official visit to Saudi Arabia since 2006. He's met Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. Mr Lee will also be briefed on Saudi Arabia's energy transition plans. Various deals will also be inked in areas like education and fintech. As Leung Waikit tells us, Mr Lee's trip comes amid heightened tensions in the region with the ongoing Israel-Hamas conflict. ASEAN member states' positions on the conflict are starkly different. Singapore has called out Hamas for what it says were abhorrent acts of terror which cannot be justified. Singapore also says that even though Israel has a legitimate right to defend its citizens and territory, it has to abide by international law, including laws of war, in doing so. Now, Malaysia, on the other hand, takes a different position. Prime Minister Anwar Ibrahim has said that Malaysia has a relationship with Hamas as a policy. Now, the topic of ASEAN's positions on the ongoing Israel-Hamas conflict looks set to be in the spotlight at the upcoming ASEAN GCC summit. Leung Wai Kit, CNA, Riyadh.